Welcome to our video on the top 10 leg exercises. Whether you're looking to build strength, tone your lower body, or simply switch up your workout routine, these exercises are sure to challenge and strengthen your legs. As a content creator, I've researched and compiled this list to provide you with a range of effective exercises that target various muscle groups in your legs. Let's become a better version of ourselves together. Lunges. Lunges are a versatile and effective exercise that can be done with body weight, dumbbells, or a barbell. They primarily target the quadriceps, hamstrings, and glutes, but also engage your core and lower leg muscles for stability and balance. To perform a lunge, start with your feet hip width apart and take a large step forward with one leg. Lower your body until both legs form a 90 degree angle keeping your front knee over your ankle and your back knee hovering just above the ground. Then, push off your front foot to return to the starting position and repeat on the other side. Lunges can be modified to target different muscle groups and add variety to your workout. For example, you can perform walking lunges by taking multiple steps forward or reverse lunges by stepping backward instead of forward. You can also add weights to increase the difficulty of the exercise. In addition to building lower body strength, lunges can also improve your balance and coordination. They require stability in your core and lower leg muscles to maintain proper form, which can translate to improved performance in other exercises and activities. However, lunges can be challenging for individuals with knee or hip pain, so it's important to consult with a fitness professional and modify the exercise as necessary. With proper form and modifications, lunges can be a great addition to your leg workout routine. Wall sits. Wall sits are a simple yet effective exercise that targets your quadriceps, hamstrings, and glutes. They are a great exercise to incorporate into your leg workout routine, as they require no equipment and can be done almost anywhere. To perform a wall sit, start by standing with your back against a wall and your feet shoulder width apart. Then, Slowly slide your back down the wall until your legs form a 90-degree angle. Your knees should be directly above your ankles, and your thighs should be parallel to the ground. Hold this position for as long as you can, making sure to keep your back flat against the wall and your core engaged. In addition to building lower body strength, wall sits can also improve your endurance and mental toughness. They can be challenging to hold for an extended period of time but practicing them regularly can help increase your muscular endurance and mental resilience. Side jumps, side jumps, also known as lateral jumps, are a plyometric exercise that can help improve your lower body strength, explosive power, and coordination. They primarily target your quadriceps, hamstrings, and glutes, but also engage your calves and core muscles for stability and balance. To perform side jumps, Start by standing with your feet together and your knees slightly bent. Then, jump to one side, pushing off your supporting leg and landing softly on your other leg. Quickly jump back to the starting position, and then jump to the other side, alternating sides with each jump. Make sure to use your arms for momentum and keep your core engaged for stability. Side jumps can be modified to increase the difficulty of the exercise. For example, you can add a hop or a tuck jump in between each side jump to make it more challenging. In addition to building lower body strength and power, side jumps can also improve your agility and coordination. They require quick movements and precise footwork, which can translate to improved performance in sports or other physical activities. Quick feet, quick feet exercise, also known as fast feet or agility ladder drills, is a high-intensity cardio and plyometric exercise that can improve your speed, agility, and coordination. It primarily targets your lower body muscles, including your quadriceps, hamstrings, calves, and glutes, but also engages your core muscles for stability and balance. To perform quick feet exercise, start by standing with your feet hip width apart and your arms at your sides. Then, quickly alternate stepping your feet in and out of the rungs of an agility ladder, keeping your feet close to the ground and moving as quickly as possible. You can vary the pattern of your steps, including forward and backward, side to side, or diagonal movements. Quick feet exercise can be modified to increase the difficulty of the exercise. For example, you can use a faster tempo, a larger agility ladder, 
or add resistance with weights or resistance bands. In addition to improving your speed and agility, quick feet exercise can also help you burn calories and improve your cardiovascular fitness. Spider Lunge Spider Lunge Exercise, also known as Spider-Man Lunge or Walking Spider-Man, is a challenging exercise that targets your lower body muscles, including your quadriceps, hamstrings, glutes, and hip flexors, as well as your core muscles for stability and balance. It's a great exercise for building strength, endurance, and mobility. To perform spider lunge exercise, start in a push-up position with your hands shoulder width apart and your feet together. Then, bring your right foot up to the outside of your right hand, keeping your knee bent and your foot flat on the ground. Your left leg should remain extended behind you, with your toes pointed towards the ground. Next, push off your right foot and return to the starting position, and then bring your left foot up to the outside of your left hand. Alternate sides with each rep, moving forward in a walking motion. Make sure to keep your core engaged and your back flat throughout the exercise. Spider lunge exercise can be modified to increase the difficulty of the exercise. For example, you can add a push-up or a mountain climber in between each spider lunge to increase the demand on your upper body and core muscles. You can also perform the exercise with weights or resistance bands to increase the challenge on your lower body muscles. In addition to building strength and mobility, spider lunge exercise can also improve your flexibility and balance. Walking side squats. Walking side squats, also known as lateral squats, are a compound exercise that targets your lower body muscles, including your quadriceps, hamstrings, glutes, and adductors. It's a great exercise for building strength, endurance, and mobility in your legs. To perform walking side squats, start by standing with your feet shoulder width apart and your toes pointing forward. Then, take a big step to your right with your right foot, keeping your left foot planted on the ground. As you step, Bend your right knee and lower your body into a squat position, keeping your back straight and your chest up. Next, push off your right foot and step back to the starting position. Then, take a big step to your left with your left foot and repeat the squatting motion. Alternate sides with each rep, moving forward in a walking motion. Make sure to keep your core engaged and your back straight throughout the exercise. Walking side squats can be modified to increase the difficulty of the exercise. For example, you can add weights or resistance bands to increase the challenge on your lower body muscles. You can also perform the exercise on an unstable surface, such as a balance board or a foam pad, to increase the demand on your core muscles. In addition to building lower body strength and mobility, walking side squats can also improve your balance and coordination. They require precise movements and control, as well as the ability to maintain your balance on one leg. Squats. Squats are a classic exercise that target your quads, hamstrings, and glutes. To perform a squat, stand with your feet hip width apart and a barbell on your shoulders. Lower your body until your thighs are parallel to the ground, then push back up to the starting position. Squats can be modified to target different muscle groups and are a great exercise for overall leg strength. Split squats. Split squats, also known as Bulgarian split squats, are a unilateral exercise that targets your quadriceps, hamstrings, glutes, and calves, as well as your core muscles for stability and balance. They're a great exercise for building leg strength and muscle mass, as well as improving your balance and mobility. To perform split squats, start by standing with your feet shoulder width apart, and take a big step forward with your right foot. Then, bend both knees to lower your body into a lunge position keeping your front knee directly over your ankle and your back knee hovering just above the ground. Next, push off your right foot and return to the starting position. Repeat the same motion on your left side, taking a big step forward with your left foot and lowering your body into a lunge position. In addition to building leg strength and muscle mass, split squats can also improve your balance and stability. They require precise movements and control, as well as the ability to maintain your balance on one leg. Side lunges, side lunges, also known as lateral lunges, are a unilateral exercise that targets your quadriceps, hamstrings, glutes, and adductors, as well as your core muscles for stability and balance. 
They're a great exercise for building leg strength and muscle mass, as well as improving your hip mobility and flexibility. To perform side lunges, start by standing with your feet shoulder width apart and your toes pointing forward. Then, take a big step to your right with your right foot, keeping your left foot planted on the ground. As you step, bend your right knee and lower your body into a squat position, keeping your back straight and your chest up. Next, push off your right foot and return to the starting position. Repeat the same motion on your left side, taking a big step to your left with your left foot and lowering your body into a squat position. Side lunges can be modified to increase the difficulty of the exercise. For example, you can add weights or resistance bands to increase the challenge on your lower body muscles. You can also elevate your front foot on a step or a bench to increase the demand on your glutes and hamstrings. In addition to building leg strength and muscle mass, side lunges can also improve your hip mobility and flexibility. They require lateral movement and stretching of your hip muscles, which can help prevent injuries and improve your overall athletic performance. Crab kicks, crab kicks, also known as crab walks, are a bodyweight exercise that target your glutes, hamstrings, quadriceps, and core muscles. They're a great exercise for building lower body strength and endurance, as well as improving your overall mobility and stability. To perform crab kicks, start by sitting on the ground with your hands placed behind your hips and your fingers pointing away from your body. Next, lift your hips off the ground and press your heels into the floor, so that your body is supported by your hands and feet. From this position, kick your right leg forward and upward, while keeping your left leg bent and your foot flat on the ground. Then, lower your right leg back to the starting position and repeat the same motion on your left side. Crab kicks can be modified to increase the difficulty of the exercise. For example, you can add a resistance band around your thighs to increase the challenge on your glutes and hamstrings. You can also perform the exercise on an unstable surface, such as a BOSA ball or a stability ball, to further challenge your stability and balance. That concludes our list of the top 10 leg exercises. Incorporating these exercises into your leg workout routine can help you build lower body strength, improve balance and stability, and increase explosive power. As always, make sure to consult with a fitness professional before starting any new exercise routine. If you found this video helpful, please like it and don't forget to subscribe. Have a good day.